Travis, a real estate agent in Los Angeles asks, hi Travis, what is the single most important thing that we should be asking in order to get them to call us back? Well, Travis, thanks for your question. And since we picked your question here to answer, I'm gonna send you a free book. This book is awesome. It's from one of my favorite authors and mentors, Dan Kennedy. Um, when, you're, uh, when you're publishing educational videos to help people out, hopefully you know, you earn their trust and they might hire you at some point, but you have to make them a pitch, a, a, an offer. You know, Hey, here's, here's what I do. Here's how I can help you. Here's why maybe you should give me money. And this book will help you craft that message. It's not so much a sales letter, but it's how to write the ultimate sales message. Uh, check it out. I'll mail it to you. I think you'll get a lot of value out of it. It's something that's really helped me in my, in my uh, profession here as a marketer at Viral. So, Travis, I want to give a little, a little context to your question first. I'm just going to assume that you're calling the people in your database. So, on the Viral Marketing Plan, you, know, you are asking permission to stay in touch, and you're gathering email addresses, and you're adding them to your database. You're sending them your two helpful educational Q&A videos a month, much like I'm shooting for you right here. And when these videos go out, through email mostly, you can actually track who watches them. So I'm assuming you're pulling that report, either through the app that you download through Emma, which is the email marketing service that we use to send your emails. You can actually download an app that will tell you in real time who's clicking and engaging. Or a couple days later, we send you the report at Viral for you to take a look at your what's called a open and click report, who opened the email and who clicked through to watch it. So you're probably calling these people up because, I don't know, let's say you sent out a video on what do I need to know before selling my home this summer? And you saw maybe say 30 people watched it. <laughs> well, might not be a bad idea to give those people a, a call, huh? So here's the deal. Your question is, they don't answer. They're not getting up. They're not reaching. They're not getting back to you. So what do you say? Well, here's what we do at Viral now. So just recently at Viral Marketing, we started a calling assistant upgrade. Uh, for 10 years, since we started Viral in, in 2009, it's almost our 10 year anniversary, uh, we would help interview you on a webcam. This is what we do. We interview you on a webcam to create educational videos, to stay in touch, and we'd send them out, and we'd give the report to call. Well, now, we also do the calling for you as your calling assistant, as your assistant. So I'm just going to give you the exact voicemail and email script real quick right here uh, that we use. So here's the voicemail script. Someone doesn't answer, how do you get them to call you back? This is what I'd say. I'm going to assume you're going to have an assistant calling on your behalf. So follow me on this here. Hi, this is Braden at you know this phone number with your company here in Los Angeles. Um, you know, uh, Travis, who I believe you know, asked me to call you. I'm his or her assistant. I'm going to email you right now at this email address with Travis's message. Give me a call back at this number. So you see how that was your assistant reaching out, calling on your behalf. You left the phone number at the beginning. You left the phone number at the end. But the the meat of the message is going to come forward in an email which is gonna slow down the need for you to be, leave this big explaining voicemail uh, that's not gonna get someone to call you back when it's super long, right? So now here's the email message um, from your assistant. Subject line is just left you a voicemail. Hey there, this is Brayden. This is the name of your assistant, let's say. I'm the assistant to Travis at this company here in this city. I just called you to leave and left a voicemail about this quick email I would send you. Uh, I see you subscribe to our local real estate video blog, thank you. Um, Travis just wanted me to ask you or let you know A, B, C, or D. Wanted me to invite you to an event, wanted me to ask you if you have any questions I can answer for you in my video blog. You can reply right back to me, I'll forward it to Travis. Also, we have a lot of people who want to buy or sell a home here in the area, uh, but there are not enough homes to sell. There's not enough you know, homes to sell for all the buyers. Any interest in selling your home or someone you know looking to sell, I'll let Travis know. And this is the email that's sent. So the voicemail references the email. This is what we do here at Viral. And we did this and we actually got a response. I'm actually gonna include in the blog post where this video is an actual email from that was sent out from Braden, who's the calling assistant for one of our clients, Jeff in Omaha, Nebraska. And individual literally respond back, hey, we, um, we have a couple homes in Midtown that we wanna sell and our thoughts on it. Give me a call. Isn't that cool? So we actually got a response from the email. So that's my answer to you. If you're looking to get people to call you back, I recommend you start by calling the people in your database that are engaging with your stuff because they're probably a little more interested in what you have to say than someone that is a stranger or you're cold calling, right? And as far as the voicemail and email script, I gave it to you. Tech technology and 
I hope it gets you some results. Thanks for watching. Oh my god. <laughs> what? Dude? This is leverage. Peter, don't screw this up. Can I just shoot my video? I'll be done in five minutes. Alright, go. Are we rolling? We're rolling. Double check. Is it rolling? Audio's good. Audio's rolling. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Is it rolling, Peter? Are we good? It's that red dot. Yeah. It's rolling. Alright. You keep those on your head. Make sure everything's good. All good? You look great. Alright. Travis, a real estate agent in Los Angeles, asks Hi, Travis.